help us kick off our hour of fun. Natalie, thanks so much for being back with us. Yeah, thanks for having me. How have things been going in the morning? Pretty good. I know I was just saying yesterday, I finally think I got my schedule down. <laughs> I say that every week and then it changes. So <laughs> who knows? But I mean, you can have a lot. <laughs> okay, that's good. That's key, I think, for the morning hours. Yeah. Well, we love seeing your reports on Today in Iowa. Uh, especially loved yesterday. Uh, we saw you actually throughout the day during the news at noon because members of the WHO 13 family were ringing bells alongside the Salvation Army at two locations. So you were at Shields in West Des Moines, right? Yes, yep, uh, from 12 to 2 o'clock yesterday. So how did that go? It kind of looked like a party out there. Oh my gosh, it was really fun. I was kind of expecting it to be a little, you know, dead because it was a Monday afternoon. Yeah. Um, but everyone was in a good holiday spirit. We saw a lot of people. Everyone was so nice. Um, yeah, and I, honestly, my, my ears were ringing for, for a few hours after that. <laughs> Let do me just still, say. Do you still hear the bell? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I was like, last night in my dreams, it was just like <laughs> ringing. <laughs> and I will say my hand started hurting, and the bell did fling out of my hand a few times, if oh, I'm no. being completely honest. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I need to get a little more coordinated with it. And there's Kaylin. Uh, we saw yeah. the shield there, the Salvation Army shield as well. I was at Bass Pro Shops in Altoona. Um, last night ringing bells from 6 to 8, so a lot of people were coming in and out to see Santa, which was really fun. Uh, here I am with our news director, Rod Peterson. So it was fun catching up with him, and we split the bell ringing duties 50-50. So <laughs> we each got to take a turn and take a break from our ears. <laughs> yep, I remember it was me, Dan, and Kaylin, and we did a little shift too. I remember <laughs> there was two bells and three of us. So Oh, so one person <laughs> had to sit out. <laughs> yep. <huh? laughs> Okay, well, we are going to do something fun, Natalie. You actually suggested this to us uh, because we're all posing for pictures right now, right, for the holidays. Yes. Well, we do that throughout the year, but, uh, but, you know, I think a lot of us are really starting to get together, take some pictures. See family, want, friends. Yeah, we want them to look good, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so uh, the third hour of today recently had a social media influencer, Michaela Pabon, who has like a ton of followers on Instagram, right? Yeah. And so she kind of gave some advice. So let's stand up, um, Natalie. Okay, so how do we do this? Touch fingertips together? Yeah, so I think the main thing here is kind of, you know, you never know what to do with your hands yes. when you're posing for a photo. So what she's saying is hold your, and I do this too sometimes on TV, I think, um, hold your fingers together so your hands aren't, you know, standing out right out in front of you. And then you can either shift your, shift your weight on one side of your foot to kind of, you know, give you like that little hip pop, or she said you can put um, one of your feet in front oh. of yourself so you look a little more like put together. Um, and then your hands look relaxed and you can just kind of smile at the camera here. And Haley's here, we'll smile. <laughs> Fun. And so we'll, we'll share some of those pictures <laughs> later in the show. Okay, so that's really good. Yeah. Um, there's another one. Oh, with the pockets. Yes, the pockets. I think this is the kind of casual vibe that everyone is going for here. Um, so it says, okay, so put your hands in your pockets. I guess here, maybe these ones would be better. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah, these front pockets here. And then make sure your thumbs are kind of sticking out. Make sure you have a relaxed look about yourself. And here again, too, you can either um, stand on you know, stand on one foot and put weight on your back hip and kind of pop your hip, or you can move your foot in front of you and I then like look that. right into a camera. Do you feel like a model? I do. <laughs> I do. You look like a model. This is perfect. You're like a pro. Okay, so how do we do this one? This one oh, looks wow. like we're supposed okay. to be natural. This is bringing me back to the days in high school when I made a fashion blog. <laughs> oh, you did? Oh, no yeah. Way. Yes, it, I did. We need to revisit that, but okay. It's, how do it's we long do gone, Megan. <laughs> so um, what they were saying here is, you know, walk oh, and yeah, look. <laughs> so look like you're walking here. That's you know, fun. Walk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're almost out of time. There's one we do want to talk about, though, because, like, group, you don't want to necessarily, yeah. well, we can stand by each other because there's just two of us. But so it's not just so posed. What do right. they say to laugh? Yeah. Or sing a song, yeah. right? So sometimes when you're in a group of few people, whether it be family or friends, um, sometimes it can be a little awkward when you're just lined up in a straight right. line. Yeah, so the suggestion is to either sing a song or kind of just laugh amongst yourselves and look. Natalie, you're so funny. <laughs> yeah, so like they recommended singing a Christmas song. <laughs> I love that. Fun 
something to do at the next holiday party. Natalie, this was so fun. We want to hear more about your fashion blog one day. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you, Megan. Thank you. <laughs> well, stay with us. Coming up, where you can get gifts for everyone on your list to help kickstart their health in the new year, or just fulfill your own grocery list, plus an exciting giveaway. And we have a real treat for you.